All right. One Punch Man. Five chapters came out today. Five. Five brand new chapters came out today, man. Yusuke been working for the past couple of weeks. Now that One Punch Man anime has been picking up a lot and everybody's been loving it, Yusuke's been like, look, man, I need to get these chapters out so I can keep getting that money. Because you already know One Punch Man, once white folk catch on to One Punch Man, then it's going to be like how Attack on Titan did. Because I'm be honest, Attack on Titan was as big as it was because of white folk. Like, once white people was like, oh my God, look at Attack on Titan, look. And then all the memes and stuff started coming out by Attack on Titan. It got huge, but. All right, One Punch Man, chapter 85 of five. Seeing like this like fly bug thing and uh, Saitama's on like some car. It's like a uh, it's just like one of those color panels and stuff. See that? Well, let me see if I can show it right up. A true hero never backs down. One Punch Man. Uh, it's just a color panel and stuff. All uh, right, let me get to. It. I haven't read One Punch Man like a dang, like a month. Like the last chapter they put out was a month was a month ago, and now. Now Yusuke put out five chapters today. I'm like, what in the world? But, hey, I'm going to get these videos done. <laughs> All right. All right. Um, tank Top. The Tank Top Army led by Tank Top Master. Atomic Samurai is three swordsmen disciples. Uh, the alliance of C-Class who often act in groups. Uh, I don't know quite know what's going on right now. It's just naming people and stuff. Uh, he who has the majority of fans and the association on his side. Sweet Mask with the privilege, with his privileges. And Metal Knight who has, who is rumored to be in control of a whole arsenal of robotic weapons. Hmm. Robotic weapons. Maybe Metal Knight, like, if y'all guys remember, if y'all watching a One Punch Man anime, which I'm pretty sure y'all are, if y'all anime fan, y'all watching the video, Y'all watching One Punch Man, and y'all remember when uh, my man with the ball head, I forgot, it was called like the Paradise Avengers or something like that, and it was going it was going around like uh, destroying like big business buildings because they was too lazy to work and they still wanted to get paid and stuff, so they was going around destroying like uh, government buildings and stuff like that, and they was like a group of all bald headed people, and then that's when we first got introduced to uh, Speed of Sound Sonic. Um, not Speed of Sound Sonic. Yeah, Speed of Sound Sonic. Yeah, I was about to say Speed of Sonic Sound. No, that is it. That is it. S speed of Sonic Sound. Because Speed of Sound Sonic sounds too good. Sp speed of Sound. Speed of Sound. Speed of Sonic Sound. All right. Speed of Sonic Sound. If it sounds weird, it's right. Always remember that about anime. If it sounds weird, it's right. But in that episode... Like, I just read this about Metal Knight saying he controls all the, uh, a whole arsenal of robotic weapons. And, like, at the end of that episode, like, after after he met up with Saitama, after, after the Sonic and Saitama had fought and stuff, and the guy with the ball head, uh, Saitama said, all right, get out of here. And he had ran off somewhere that at the very end of the episode, uh, showed, like, a, um, a little preview of, like, some robots. Um, that looked at him and then had killed him and stuff, like cyborgs and stuff. I don't know if they were cyborgs, but they were robots and stuff, but, um, yeah. Last but not least, uh, Blizzard Group, that represents the largest facts and amongst professional heroes. It all sums up the current situation of the existing factions. Amongst these groups, no other faction can work as efficient as a team than ours. Um, Commander Miss Blizzard. Oh, that's her name, Blizzard. I forgot her name. I ain't seen her since like chapter. I think about chapter um 76 or something like that. 
It's been a minute. Hold up, maybe earlier than that. Yeah, probably like. Brenda, what? The Christmas tree out the garage upstairs. All right. Look, I'm going to take you to the bank and um, borrow $10, $20 from you until I get paid in the morning. Well, I thought I got paid today, but I don't get paid until tomorrow morning. Uh, $10 for what? Tomorrow. I need to get gas in my car. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm going to take you to the bank and get um, borrow $10, $20 from you until I get paid in the morning. If it's my money, I gotta ask. All right, back to this. All right, um, talking about uh, Metal Knight. Uh, last but not least, uh, I'm on this page now. See. Let me see. Page, page three, pound of three. Yeah, page three. Last but not least, our Blizzard group that represents the largest faction amongst professional heroes. This about sums up the current situation of existing factions. Amongst these groups, no other faction can work as efficient as a team, as as a team, than ours. Under the command of Miss Blizzard, we we conquer. The monsters and defeat them. That's her name. Uh, Tatsumaki's sister. I forgot. <sighs> God, man. Yana. I'm sorry. I forgot her freaking name, man. But her name is Blizzard. That's what it is. Uh, the labor division ensures that your rank does not drop. So you should be really grateful that Miss Blizzard wants you in her team. Are you even listening? <laughs> he talking to Saitama and stuff. Uh, some dude that sent on um, Blizzard like facts. I think she trying to get Saitama to uh, recruit. She trying to she trying to recruit Saitama and stuff, but he probably doesn't even want to do it. Just like nah, I'm straight. I just want to be a hero by myself. Um, these guys playing video games under the desk. Oh, this guy's playing video games under the desk. Oh. <laughs> what he brought his DS in or something? Uh, then. This again is Saitama talking. Aren't you getting tired of this? And then uh, Blizzard sitting down and stuff. That's Blizzard right up. Oh, you remember the girl that had attacked him when he was like at his uh, at his house and he was just chilling. And then some girl came outside and attacked him and stuff. And then he and then she used like um like uh um tele telekinetic powers and stuff and like threw rocks and um and uh, billboards and signs at him and stuff. And he just punched her. And he just punched her and then like he just lightly tapped her like and then that was it and she was done but, um yeah she is Takasamaki's uh, sister the one I forgot her name Miss Blizzard why are you being so patient with this guy we've got everything over one we've got everyone here if we gang up on them at once we might be able to beat them yeah, and she says, impossible. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Impossible. All y'all niggas are dying like... I think Saitama can use his pinky to just straight up um, murder everybody. He is strong. I dare I dare to say he's probably the strongest amongst the B-class. What? <laughs> he's stronger than S-class, man. Like, come on. There's no, harming, there's no harm in inviting him. Saitama, uh, I think this is Blizzard talking. Saitama, if we can't convince you, then how about a fair and square competition? Fair and square competition. Competition? Yeah, the Blizzard group against the Saitama group. It's just Saitama and Genos. Like, what? I don't, I don't understand. The losers have to do whatever the winner team tells them to. Uh, being your... Yeah, and like, I don't, one thing while I'm reading this chapter... This chapter has nothing to do with last chapter. Like, I don't even remember Saitama even going to no, like, freaking thing with um, Blizzard. Like, I don't even remember that. Like, that's just, that's off the wall. Uh, bring your memories tomorrow. Then we'll tell you how we're going to dis um, decide the winner. No, members, not memories, members. Bring your memories tomorrow. It's just Saitama and Genos. Hold on, there's no Saitama group. Is that so? You can come by yourself if you want. Not like I expect anything else with your reputation. 
Do you even know what fan squared is? Oh my gosh. I'm not tired, man. I don't know why. I think I'm talking a lot. That's how come I'm yawning. So I wonder if that jerk is going to show up. <laughs> and it's like, uh, like right there. Hold up. Let me see. Right there at the bottom, like reservation stuff. Let's see, reservation. All right, reservation between 10:30 and 12:30 Blizzard Group. It'll definitely come. He's that simple-minded. And then something like Slam. Here, told you. Here, told you his name. What? I don't even understand that. Oh snap! I had a feeling. <laughs> Yo, I had a feeling, man. That freaking bang was gonna come, but not just bang. King came too, plus Genos. Like, look, right at the top, man. Right there, dog. Like, look at that. <laughs> but, hey, if you read the manga, then you already know what's going on with King. So I ain't even got to tell you that. But you know they're going to be scared and stuff. But they look, yo, they look so badass. And then Saitama just looks like he's supposed to be in some freaking, like, he's supposed to be in a comedy, um, anime and stuff and he's just standing there with his like his weird outline they're so drawn they're so defined and drawn so well and then look at Saitama look at his look how he's drawn his art style and stuff it's funny uh S-Class rank 14 Dim Cyborg Genos S-Class rank 3 Silver Fang Bang S-Class rank 7 King B-Class rank 7 Saitama well um, uh, I thought Saitama was already in A-Class. He might have been. I don't know. Hold up. Was Saitama already? No. Oh, uh, nah. Yeah, it's right. Yeah, it's right. But then once Saitama started moving up, like, really fast, um, the freaking, um, the, uh, I think his name is Handsome Man. Handsome Man had came to Saitama and was like, hey, man, you need to slow down moving up through the ranks so fast. Like, if you keep going through the ranks so fast, you gonna um, move over to L to S class, and I don't want you to move over to S class because nobody gets past me. And it's like it's a whole nother thing that I go into at the end of this uh at the end of this chapter review and stuff. So, uh, what are these? What are these? His members? It's like some guy freaking out. Miss Miss Bl Miss Blizzard, it's not looking good. Relax, all all within my expectations. So you really came, Saitama? Yo. God, the likes of you dare to waste Saitama Sensei's precious time. You know, talking the uh, Blizzard and stuff. I'm not gonna let this one slip. <laughs> you sound mad, you know. <laughs> and then all those guys over there freaking out and stuff. Are we gonna be okay? So that's your, so that's your Saitama group. And then uh, Blizzard's talking and stuff. That's not true, but oh well. These three acquaintances are the ones who responded to my call. What kind of team battle is it going to be? Uh, and then she pulled, like, some paper out of the box. And stuff. Like, she pulled some paper out of the box. See the box right there? All the way at the end right there and stuff? Right there where my thumb is. And then she pulled some paper out. Uh, before that, can the team representative please sign this contract? We're going to have a fair and square competition. It's all written in here. Don't complain if you get hurt. That's fine. And then Saitama just signed like nothing. Like, he just signed like, yeah, whatever. All right. The loser team will obey every command of the winner team. And then she started like, foo, 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 foo. You've actually signed this. And then Saitama like, uh, that was written there. Dude, Saitama. And then King talking to Saitama like, dude, Saitama. You need to start reading your contracts and manuals from now on. And then, um, like, uh, I think that's laughter going on back there by the, uh, by the people that's in the Blizzard group. Uh, let's get ready for a battle. Make sure, make some room, put the tables aside. Sensei, let, let me handle it so they will not bother you again. Wait, Genos Kun, and bang, talking to Genos. Please let me do this. Please let me do this first. I will make sure they don't get hurt badly. <laughs> but I ain't gonna mess them up. But I ain't gonna mess them up too bad. 
see this as a sparring match. Everyone from the loser team has to join my dojo to train. Chunk or Chiroko, Chiroko will surprise will be surprised he gets this many fellow students. <laughs> That's crazy. Alright. And then bang. Uh what is this? What's going on? Bang, what's wrong? You're the one on the right on the right bang. Hello, what's going on? Stop hitting this section. Stop hitting the select button. All you do is taunting. That's not an attack. Hello. Hello, man. What? Hello. Are they playing a video game? Like, let me see. Like, yeah. Look at the top panel. Like, it just switched from them being in some room to like that. And I think they're talking about they're being in a video game. Man, he. Silver Fang Bang has been taken out. They playing a video. They were playing a video game. Who, 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 who? Who told you we'd fight you directly? It's even written in the contract how we're settling this. This is a fair. This is a fair and square uh, battle. We have the right to choose him to go first. That's all. B class rank 65. Uh, Pinko, former pro gamer. They cheated. They got a gamer to play those guys. Man, didn't nobody even know. Like, first of all, how is she going to not tell Saitama that they was going to be playing a video game the entire time? Like, what's up with that? All right, Sensei, the controller isn't responding. Uh, now nah, Geno's playing. Uh, <laughs> you crushed the controller when you grabbed it. Push, pushing harder doesn't make your attacks go harder. Yeah. <laughs> I <laughs> did. Saitama and Bang said over there like, I failed with the uh with the little black over there on face and stuff. Like they're like I failed, and then Jen on you no know, Saitama like can't be helped. Now it's my turn. To tell you the truth, I played this game before. Don't take me as lightly as those beginners, Bang and Jenos. Just wait, I'll win this, and KO. Perfect. <laughs> The guy perfect to KO uh, Saitama. But, hey, y'all already know, man. If y'all read the manga, y'all know about King. Like, King is going to be a beast of games because I don't wanna really want to spoil it, but King might not be what you think he is, and that's all I'm going to say. All right, and then Blizzard's laughing. Ha, 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 ha. King is the only one left. All you do in your life is fighting. You think you can beat us in a game? If you lose, then all of you, including Saitama, have to join Blizzard Group. And then King just looking scared as ever. And then it transitions to Y-City for some reason. All right, Y-City. Welcome, everyone. Child's Emperor's Lab. Child Emperor. I forgot what rank Child Emperor is. Uh, this is my newest invention. Okeme, Okeme-chan. I don't know what that is. Um... This thing can, this thing can scan the body for muscle mass and the development of nerves, uh, blanching it out with your weight, blanching it out with your weight. It can determine the strength of your body. For example, if I can, if I can scan everyone who arrived here. Uh. Oh no, yeah, it did say if I can. I yawned again, man. My bad. If I can. And, uh, I think that is that guy's right there. Uh, Class C, rank 89, Red Muffler. Yeah, I don't know who that is. He looks like a uh, um, licenseless rider, though. Let's use Class C as our benchmark. Red Muffler's body strength has been set to set as 100. Bleep, 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 bleep. Let's proceed, and then they put, they doing like some other people. B class rank fifty, dark blade, darkness blade. Uh, A class rank thirteen, great philosopher. That dude looks like Zeus. A class rank ten, Stinger. Oh yeah, we knew about Stinger before. He fought Sea King, so those guys. Like Stinger, all the way right down the left. My left, your right, probably. Uh, yeah. Two new guys and Stinger fought against Sea King. When Z fought off all the other, um, like the fishmen, um, and killed them, 
before Sea King came out and then just destroyed him. Uh, Hero Association staff. This means even a Class C is above regular humans. Then that dude has like a bear in a cage for some reason. A bear. Then they uh, and the dude that did freaking uh, the guy that had told them about uh, about the old like lady that had died and stuff. <laughs> Prophecy, countermeasure, team leader, Shinshi. Because your body is too weak in comparison to the hero, to a hero's, an error occurred. <laughs> like, uh, like that dude down there. That guy is talking about. Alright, I know it's taking me a long time to read this one. I'm just trying to go through it all. Alright, that is a wonderful invention. Well, the idea is that with this, you can rate heroes based on their strength alone. Using it, using it on monsters could make the estimation of their class of their classes better as well. Uh, so he actually invented something that helps out the hero association. All right, and then it said, boop, 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 boop. "What the?" And then uh, S class rank five child emperor. Isn't the, isn't he just a child? Like his is a is like a thousand eight hundred and eighty. Um, pretty low, pretty low stats. Am I right? I've been doing some training, but my body is still that of a ten year old. But in my case, and then like the caution light went off, like yeah. And monster alert is right here. What? Emergency alert. A monster has been spotted in Y City. Disaster level tiger. Like, disaster level tiger is the second disaster level. Meaning that it's, it's, uh, it's dangerous enough to where it can, um, harm a lot of people in that immediate area, but not the whole city. You got, I think you, you got, um, what's before tiger? Ah, uh, dang. No, it's tiger, demon, Dragon and God. That's what it is. Yeah. Tiger's the first rank. All citizens, please, please see the see the nearest building. A great opportunity. Let's go record a monster stats. This isn't the time for that. And staying telling this isn't the time for that, man. We need to do something else. Now you can be ready to go in about 30 minutes. Yeah. Did you order something for $199 down on the internet? No. The book called your mama said um, it was a fraudulent, um, um, somebody tried to get a, order someone $199 on your card. I didn't order none. Well, they're going to send you a new card. The mama canceled that girl. In order to cancel that order, they had to send you a new card. All right. Go ahead, go ahead, Alright. Now it looks like the city is covered in webs and stuff. And it is covered in webs. It's like a spider with like a skull face on it, like a punch of skull face on it. And it's like, ooh. Like some dude and a spider? Some dude connected to a spider or something. Look at that. Look at that. It looks nasty. Ugh. I don't like spiders like that, man. Like when we first moved there, it was a lot of spiders in my house. And I had to kill like 20. It was, ugh. I don't like them. Like monster jumping spider. A monster spider? Uh, okay, Chan. Reads 402. Well, four two. That's not. That's not that much. They should be able to handle that easy. The body's even weaker than the bear. Worst case scenario, even without heroes, a group of citizens with proper tools can handle it. They warned us about level tiger, but maybe wolf is sufficient. Oh yeah, wolf. Wolf level two. I knew tiger was the second one. I knew I was forgetting one. Yeah, tiger was the second one because it's wolf, tiger, um. 
demon, dragon, and God. That's what it is. Uh, the man of the man of seven hundred fifty nine dark darkness blade shall take shall take care of it. Uh, sounds like a quite sounds like he's quite fond of it. And then, boom! Darkness blade got hit, and he just got demolished. Like he just got wrecked, man. And what? Strange that it shouldn't happen. It was definitely four twenty before. Now what is it? Uh, on the low, the lower body, that um, monstrous part has a completely different reading. Man, he was reading the guy that was attached to the um, spider, not the actual whole entire thing. He was just reading the um, the guy that was attached to it on the top. But the spider reading is six thousand nine hundred and ninety nine, almost seven thousand. Whoa! Correction. Turns out this thing is disaster level demon. Mm. Whoa, that's crazy. It's gonna take all of them to beat that jump. Uh, you're telling us only, you're telling us only now. You tell, <laughs> you tell them. <laughs> oh, that, was, <laughs> uh, that was um, uh, darkness blade in the back land on the ground. Sting was like, uh, you and you're telling us this only now, and then darkness blade was in the back like, you tell them. That jump was fun. <laughs> And uh, wait, uh, philosopher dude, I forgot his name, like philosopher something. He was like, three tons philosophy, man. I think that's his, like, his, like move or something. And then him and Stinger got hit. They was went flying. Then uh, the dude with the book, the spider that took the philosopher dude's book and Sting's, uh, like, Stinger. And it was like, web? Crap, my weapon. And then, um... Like, uh, Kid Emperor got hit. But Kid Emperor should be able to beat him. He's S-Class. Even though he's still a kid, he's still S-Class. Like, uh, and then the thing is, ha, 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 chee, 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 is laughing. All this happened because I don't remove the spider that went into my ear. He said, all this happened because I didn't remove the spider that went into my ear. So, a spider crawled in his ear probably when he was sleeping. And then... Somehow, he merged with the spider. Like that's kind of weird. I feel so good. I can accomplish anything now. To me, all of you are fodder. Now let me now let me start with those who dare to fight back. And then the dude is about to eat that. Uh, like I think his name is Red Muffler. Uh, the spider is about to eat Red Muffler. Red Muffler is crying. But then you see like look like Bane's waves. Oh, and it, it, I think it was, and it was Bang. Bang came, he, Bang came and saved him. Like, be careful. Like, they was Bang that came and saved him and stuff. Like the uh, flowing fish, flowing uh, water technique or whatever Bang uses. And then Genos has shot the dude on top, uh, incinerate and uh, spider. And um, do the stop. And then here come, here come Saitama. I'm like, oh, nice combination right there, you two. Uh, which means let me know that they won the uh, thing. Or King is still back there playing the whole entire Blizzard uh, group and that, um, and that, like, Street Fighter game. So let me deal with this finishing blow. It's over. And the spider shot webs at Genos and stuff. And then Genos trying to, um, not Genos, but Saitama. Saitama trying to punch him, but he can't. And now, uh, Kid Emperor is walking towards, he has, like, some, um, look like he a spider. With his, like, contraption and gadget he has and stuff. How dare you send me flying, spider monster? With body strength alone, you cannot measure, you cannot measure what I'm capable of. The reason why I'm S-Class, the reason why I'm S-Class, how about a little demonstration? Ah, all overall ready? Hold up, did Genos or, or uh, Kid Emperor defeat it? I know, not Genos. But did Saitama or Kid Emperor defeat it? I don't know. Uh, Kid Emperor? Was it him? Might have been Kid Emperor, I don't know. But Daryl King and stuff said, ah, Child Emperor. Ah, so, so it was Master King who took care of it. 
a sensor to measure to measure body strength. Yes, by by digesting it, we can have a better understanding of fighting capability. This is going to be the next big hit. With some improvements, I'm sure it can read the stats even more precisely. Ah, uh, no need to read me. I prefer not to not to get involved with this. Is that so? But he's still reading Bang anyway. Bang was like, oh, don't read me. And he's still reading Bang anyways. And General's like, uh, Master, Demon Cyborg is almost complete, complete machine. So the readings won't even won't be sufficient either. Then how about the old man in the spider webs? Who are you calling an old man? Saitama was like, who are you calling the old man? Because Kid Ever calls Saitama old man. It's probably because he's bald, but whatever. He's got his own hero's name. His hero's name now. He's called Cape Baldy <laughs> Crack. Oh, snap. He tried to read Saitama, and the mask had cracked. So that lets you know how strong Saitama's body is. Uh, you know what, old man? You know what? Old man is fine. Like, what did um, Saitama uh, measure up to? What was King's? What was Bang's? What was Genos's? What was Saitama's? Huh? What happened? Um, huh? Unidentified? Oh man, are you a professional? You're a professional hero, right? B class. I find that hard to believe. You're so weak, the numbers aren't showing. Just between us, I think you should train a little. <laughs> Egg not. It's not what happened. Saitama was so strong that the mask cracked. Couldn't read it. You're just like an out of shape average person. All right, Mr. King. Oh, I can't hear. Oh, I can hear the King engine. Oh, oh, God. I can hear the King engine, huh? Unidentified again. I see how it is. I see how this is. Oh, Kim and John cannot go beyond nine, 9,999. So you're so strong, it goes beyond numbers. Again, they don't even know that King sucks. Scary bumps. Sorry about that. I know you were looking forward to it. Nah, it's fine. You're the top B-class blizzard, blizzard of hell, right? Please let me um, please let me test you as well. For your information, Class C heroes are at an average of 100. What's the matter, Fubuki? I don't know what they're talking about. Like, it's weird. I don't know what they're talking about. I'm just reading, man. She's still in shock because King alone, King alone beat all 30 of them in one go. I told you. Didn't I tell you King beat them in that game, man? Come on. How could King? I can't believe it. The Saitama group, just four of them. I challenged them with 30 of my guys. Are my connections not good enough? I got the numb. I got the I got the number blizzard of hell. Nineteen. Whoa. She weak as ever. She worse than a regular person. Well she is like a regular person. Yeah, she worse than that. Dang. <laughs> Nineteen. I'm I'm even below C class. Are you overacting? She got down on her knees like nineteen. What? All right, we should leave her and go home. But won't. But we won. Remember, even if she's upset, a loss is a loss. Yeah, Saitama, a loss is a loss. I can't let this go on. This man is going to take over my rank. I have a feeling. The B class rank, I I said, B class number one seat that I worked so hard for. Everything is going to fall apart. Hey, get a grip, Saitama telling her to get a grip. You made the same mistake with rankings and numbers. You care too much about the upper part. Yeah, because Tatsubaki is S rank. And she desperately wants to be S rank, but she's not. And Tatsubaki is her older sister, believe it or not. And then she's laughing, like some Simpson laugh. Guys like you don't understand what I'm going through. Being in lead is all that counts. Showing others that you're stronger than them 
taking a higher up position than the rest so they don't see your weakness. That's Blizzard talking. That person is just like that. Always how without ever showing weakness. And she's talking about Tatsumaki. Uh, then you just don't, didn't try hard enough. If you really want to become strong, and then bang, like I said, hmm? And then, like, cut Saitama right off. And was like, I sent something. And then, are these black dots on the ground moving? A little king is saying, like, countless life signals. These are. And then Saitama was like, <gasps> and then it's like, stop caring about what your surroundings, what your surroundings thinks of you. And it's like, he's still talking to Blizzard and stuff. Um, living your life has nothing to do with what others think. These are spiderlings. Spiders, so spiders are all over the ground. They're crawling out from the dead, the dead monster's body. And the guy was like, oh, S. I think I think there's some kind of parasite. We mustn't we mustn't let a single one escape. Like Shinji, God, man, parasite like Shinji. And then Jenna's like, dang, can't I just incinerate the surroundings? Don't you'll hurt the stand the uh, the bystanders. The thing you just said, I already know. You don't have to remind me. And then she like powered up. She like powered up or something. I think she's going to take out all the spiders and stuff. That's what I'm thinking. Hopefully that happens. And she did do that. Nice panel. She did do that. It doesn't matter if you if you and my sister are stronger than me. And she took them out. Uh, I have my own method of handling things. I was only a little taken aback bef before because, the, because of King's strength whatever I admit my defeat this time I'm going home now but this doesn't mean I have I have given up if you'll excuse me all right you can't go yet there's a promise the there's a promise the loser has to fulfill remember ah I forgot yeah you forgot I you was trying to run away with if and thinking that he would forget your Tatsumaki chance older sister right the part that um, can't be uh, quantified is actually quite significant oh so she's the older sister yeah I forgot this thing really has no use in real combat and then um, the uh, kid Emperor I forgot kid Emperor didn't even notice that his mask had cracked had cracked because he had it on the entire time so the outside of it must have cracked and not the whole thing uh, with our current technology, it's still impossible to um, what is it, designate strength. Huh? This thing's completely broken. What's that crack? Oh, so he, now he's looking at the crack. Talking about some what's, what's that and stuff. He's going to find out what that crack is. And now they're at a, a restaurant mammoth. Sirloin. No, the filet has less fat. No, butter, please. No butter, please. And the salad dressing. Wait, wait a minute. Let's go back. Calculating calories. And then freaking Saitama just like, oh, so Saitama uh, was like, hey, take us out to eat. That's the uh, promise you, you got to make to us. You got to fulfill to us and stuff. Man. That's the end of the chapter and all that stuff, man. I'll show y'all again. End of the chapter. Uh, and then, like, oh, uh, you know, whatever. Oh, God. I don't know where I'm at. Yeah, that's the next chapter, man. Let me know your thoughts on all that, on the whole entire chapter and what was going on and stuff. Saitama, uh, Blizzard, Tatsumaki, everything was going on. I think this chapter was like a kind of a filler chapter, which is not is not filler because it's it's like it's canon. It's it's in the manga, so it's gonna be canon towards the episode when the episode comes out because there is gonna be a new season of. One Punch Man, that's gonna happen. You already know that's gonna happen. One Punch Man is too great, too awesome right now. They gotta cash in on some of this, on some of this greatness that is um having right now. Let me know your thoughts and all of that, man. Put your comments, share the video, like, subscribe, and all that. Put your comments down in the comments and everything. But I'm Danny Awesome. You're awesome. Stay awesome. My lovely face, peace, one love. I'm out.